Hello everyone, welcome back to KJ Gaming Network. This is City Skylines After Dark. We're going to do a little bit of a series. We're going to create some new things and we're going to play around with the new After Dark. This may take a little while to build up to unlock the new taxi cabs, but at least we can enjoy the day and night cycle. So we're going to go ahead and pick a new game. And now to pick a map. I want something with water access and trains because I plan on building a giant rail net. Not sure how it will be, but we'll mess around with it. Okay, we got Diamond Coast. Maybe that might be a good one to do. Sandy Beach. Two rivers. Can't do two rivers. Shady Strands, Islands, Blackwood, River Run. And Cliffside Bay. I'm thinking along the lines of Diamond Coast or Sandy Beach. I don't think I've done either of these maps actually. There's a couple of maps I haven't done. I've done River Run, Blackwoods, Islands, Great Plains and those. I'm not so sure about Sandy Beach and Diamond Coast. Okay, so they both have pretty much a great amount of trees. The only difference is Diamond Coast has a lot more uh, ore. So I'm thinking maybe we should go Sandy Beach because then we can have some yeah, let's go Sandy Beach. As for city name, I have no idea. Just name it something random. Pensacola. And we'll wait while this loads. Okay, we have loaded onto our map. Also, we're going to go ahead and change our color correction before I forget to. I went ahead and downloaded a color correction to try out. I believe we're going to go with Scotland Tom's Wild Wilderness or Super Vibrant. For now, we'll use Wild Wilderness. Let's see what else it looks like. Hmm, Vibrant looks pretty good. Uh, we'll go with this one for now. We'll switch back and forth, I assume. Anyways. So this is our area, we're going to zoom out here and see our other claims we can get. Not bad, looks kind of nice. We can build our downtown we'll tourism area around this area. Okay, I think this is a pretty good map. So we'll go ahead and get this built. We're going to go ahead and build a regular, I don't want to do a round belt. Uh, do we have four lanes? Okay, we do have four lane roads. I have this network edition thing on, so it's a little weird on how to use it, but we should get around it. So that's 40 cents a sale. That's 32 cents a sale. Uh, let's just do a small one. So we're going to go straight as best as we can. About right here, we're going to go about like this should work. Go out about by three. Make a small like, rectangle right here. So this will be the base part, I would assume. And we'll switch this back so it will be one way. There we go. As far as this concerned, I don't really care if this is two-way or one-way. It'd probably be best though if we did it one-way, so let's switch it out here. There we go, one-way. And do we have any lights right here? Nope, we do not have any lights, that's good. Okay. So we got $60,000, we want to spend this wisely. So what I want to do is I want to make a residential area on one side of the map, which will probably be over here. Put industrial over here, along with commercial down the middle. 
Not sure if that would make any sense to do so, but hopefully maybe it might work or do something for us, such as, uh... Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and continue this. So, let's make this go down about here. Then make some curved roads somewhere. Go ahead and curve out over here so we can go and build our industrial. Okay, we got 48,000. It's enough to get power and some residential built. As far as sewage goes, it's going to be a long thing of pipes is what we're going to have to do. I prefer to do solar, I mean uh, wind turbines because that would be the cheapest to do. If not, we can do uh, coal, which would give us enough power for a while. I guess we'll have to go wind turbine. Let's go ahead, how much is this? Purifier. Okay, let's go ahead and get down a water pipe. One second. Is water actually moving? Much, anyways? You know, well, that's wind. Water. I actually have no idea. You see it moving a little bit right here? You don't want to put it like right in our area so that way we have diarrhea flowing all the way over there. So I don't know what we'll do. We'll probably do, I guess, a purifier. It's freaking expensive too though. Well, I guess we're forced. We don't have much money left. Go ahead and cover up our grids. Okay, now for power. What's the best area? Okay, we can put some over here in this area, so that way we have some close power. Or we can just put it over here on the coast. We'll just put it on the coast. Okay, 6,000. Or we can just still do our coal power plant. I guess we would just go ahead and just do our coal power plant just so we'll have plenty of power for a while. We'll just have to take a electrical line all the way down it. Okay, water tower. Where do we want to put you? Okay, let's go ahead and lay out our residential area.
Okay, we're ready to fast forward in time. So hopefully we can increase our income so that way we don't go bank, uh, bankrupt so quickly. You know what, let's change this. I'm not running power all the way over there because we kind of can't afford it. So we'll just put some right here, industrial. As for hopefully some type of, uh, let's go ahead and cut you out right here. Hopefully some buildings will build right here and it will spread off our electrical grid so we don't have to run a line right there, which we kind of can't do. We'll go ahead and remove some of this too. So that way they kind of have to build over there. Yeah, do you have power now? Yes, you got power. Good. Okay, we're going to continue laying this out how we had it a second ago. And I'll play some more commercial. We are still in depth. Okay, we need to work on more industrial. We can just change this later on. We're going to make it so they can build on this main highway just for now. Our milestone will be at 500 residents. We're currently at 400. We are ten thousand dollars in debt. Just great. Hey, five hundred people now. Okay then, now. Okay, here we go. We got loans now. We can take out a loan. That should help us. Oh, we are making positive now. Okay. So we got twenty thousand dollars that took out our our debt area. We got some industrial growing here. Once we get district, districts unlocked, we'll make this into like a little forestry area. And we'll move our city vitals around. And what do we have for... Okay, we can't check that just yet. I wanted to see if any of this land right here is fertile. Fertile. Let's go ahead and lay out some more roads. Sorry, but your house kind of needs to move. You're you're kind of in the way. I don't really want our residential to be just straight lines like this. I want to do something a little different, like adding in swerves and stuff like that. So don't expect it to go just straight flat. Sorry, 
Fairy Houses. I want to move you a bit. So this will be our main road, which will be our highway. So we'll just go ahead and make this go straight for now. Have you come back down here at the connection point. And then we can mess around right here and add a little bit more space. And we'll leave this little gap right here open. We can probably add like a bike, a bike, uh, a biking trail, pretty much, I guess you could say. There we go. Garbage service, that's what we need to come up with next. Let's go and add a little bit more commercial somewhere. Oh, that's what we could do. We could add commercial right here. Since we kind of bulldozed all these houses here. And this is an actual, will be a four by four street eventually. Just not in its current time period. Maybe in a couple of years from now. <laughs> Hopefully not, but yeah. Uh, we'll go ahead and take out a loan for the garbage. Let's also go ahead and upgrade these roads if it will let us. Oh yeah, so this is the new road that we got. Small heavy roads. This is from Network Extension. Here's our medium road with the actual 4x4. Here's the regular one. Here's some new ones. This one is a four lane road with parking spaces for medium traffic. Four lane road with turning lanes. Um, allows parking spaces and supports medium traffic. Note, running lane goes in both directions. Collisions might happen. Okay. So the small heavy one, we got some one-way roads. Three lane, one way. A uh, small four lane, one way. And then we got our regular four lane road. So this four lane road is actually kind of nice. So how much are you? You're 40. Okay, you're, you're pretty much the same. So at least then we can increase our capacity on the road. We'll go ahead and do this. So we have two lanes per per direction. So we can keep it either like that, or we can make it a one way. Okay, let's go ahead and place down the garbage dump. Then we can eventually add one more right here. There we go, we got garbage trucks now.
There we go. Not bad. Okay, we can either add a health care of some sort or a school. Pharmacy won't be bad. Let's do that. We can put you right here on the corner. Soda pop. Wow, a lot of people are actually sick. You see a couple of people actually going in. Patient, 1650. So yeah, healthcare helped a lot more than a school would have. Possibly, that is. We got a Dairy Queen, I think. No? Barbecue? We got a McDonald's. A Pennies. This color textual texture is actually kind of nice. Uh, let's go ahead and increase our taxes by a little bit. I usually go up to like 10%. I can't leave commercial where it is, but we'll go ahead and raise it up a little too. Just so we're a little positive since we started going down under for a bit. And our green is now a lot. Look at our residential demand. It's high. So we'll go ahead and add some more residential. Just, just add all of that. Hey guys, thanks for watching episode 1. Like if you like it, subscribe if you want to see more. Hopefully we can have a lot more recorded for this. Thanks for watching.